Lol, but hope. That's, that's, that's what I gotta say. How's everyone doing? I'm Annie. We're gonna give Minecraft Story Mode Season 2 another chance. It's so weird how much worse it is than the first season. Because the first season's wonderful. Both halves of it. But the second season has just been kind of shit. But it's been made a lot more fun just by y'all being here, so I'm glad we get to share in this. Let's see, where it, where where are you, Minecraft Story Mode Season 2? Here it is. It's a little further down in the list than I was thinking because it's been a couple weeks. How's everyone doing tonight? We're on the new Twitch dashboard, which is fine i hated it at first now i just dislike it a little it's got more problems than the old dashboard which already had problems but it's fine it does what it needs to it is mostly a downgrade except that i can add more buttons to it now Okay, I'm I'm glad y'all don't mind the ads. Theoretically, we can get paid for them, but I absolutely don't mind if y'all want to block them because we don't get paid a lot for them. Just, just to make that clear, they don't give us very much. Um, I did not switch scenes, or oh yes, I did. It's just my preview fucked off. All right, good. I love it when my preview fucks off. That's the best. It's continuing to fuck off, in fact. Um, it is not capturing, huh? I love how this game decides it's not going to capture every time I start it up. Alright, there. We got it now. I love how it changes how it's not going to capture every week. It's such a... It's so good. <laughs> this is... This is... It sure is a thing, huh? Theoretical dollars go towards the theoretical upheaval of cock, so add away. <laughs> All right. Yeah, once we can move out of this neighborhood to a neighborhood where there's another ISP available, we're switching, I'll tell you that. Why is Jesse dressed like Chell? Episode 3, Jailhouse Blog. Oh, did we get thrown in jail? I don't even remember how the last one ended. Jesse and the gang must brave a dangerous prison, and it's even more dangerous inmates to reach the secret at the prison's heart. But when the enemy tries... To recruit Jesse's friends, will they be able to resist the call? Yeah, it's... I'm probably not supposed to talk about the exact amounts, at least on stream, so I'm not gonna, but it's not much. Oh, you don't like my uh, my frame wallpaper mocks? I love that. I love that picture. The world can be a very scary place. All right, I can't. Can be larger than life. Fucking and almost mute during this game either, which is also great. The stress of saving the world can turn even the best of friends against each other. And not everyone will be on your side. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't even remember it. Some will try to take advantage this has been super things, forgettable. But a true hero will know exactly what to do. And will inspire It's just been a lot save. of nothing. The scariest thing of all, even for the bravest hero... What a surprise. The guy I said was going to turn out to be the admin was the admin. This 
It's about as, as subtle as a pencil to the eye. Yeah, that's the thing, is it's so unmemorable that I've forgotten half of it. Which is so weird, coming out of Minecraft Story Mode Season 1. Which I remember just about everything except for the YouTuber chapter. What the heck is this? Um, where's my stuff? The gauntlet. I hear the gauntlet's gone, Tlet. Gotta get back. Find the admin. Find my friends. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Right, that's what I said, Bad Road. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. I mean, it's a speaker. He's not going to hear me if I say anything. Throat clearing sound. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Floor to the check -in zone. Yeah. I heard you. <laughs> Not gonna do it though, just gonna stand here. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check in zone. No, she won't. They get the lava. Jeez, got it. Point made. Aw. It's lame. No, we're going this way. up that reminds me isn't it against the twitch affiliate agreement to export vods for 24 hours after streaming that's like sort of like that's what they say but like even partners do it anyway i i our, our channel, we don't do it for 24 hours just to be on the safe side. I know you're not allowed to dual stream. Go on, yes, and it's okay. So I guess I'm not going to get the lava no matter how long I stand here. Oh, what I wouldn't give for a grapple away button. How come Batman got a good sequel game? Second season of Batman is fucking great. Alice gets that, and I get stuck with this. I guess season one of Minecraft was better than season one of Batman, though. Place where I'd never see the light of day again. What is this place? Though season one of Batman was good, and this is kinda less so. Remember to keep the quote bot going, y'all. How was your day? Oh, it was great. Met a red, glowy, all-powerful, crazy person who trapped me in a near indestructible cage. <sighs> hey, lava, yeah. my favorite. I'm sure this is leading me to a place. Oh, thanks, Streamlabs quote bot. Here. Just said it right after I did. Sunshine. Oh. Oh, great. Right, I remember now. Mental institution, lol. Because apparently it's 1985. Oh, don't mind Big Hank. He's just here to make sure all guests behave themselves. Let's see, let's see, let's see. And now we have a guy who looks yes. like a Nazi. Jesse. Welcome to the Sunshine Institute. It's a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. I'll be your warden. So, the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. Well, the admin is in this close to quitting right now, if I'm being units, honest. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. I'm sure we'll get along just famously. Maybe we'll even be, uh friends someday so it's a prison hey no no we don't use the p word here but it 
is a prison. Let's not challenge authority. The admin doesn't let us use that word, so we don't use that word. Understand? You know he's not here right now, right? You never know. Giving this this one chance. Maybe it'll be really cleverly written. Maybe they'll subvert our expectations here. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, man, lucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. The admin has all this stuff built. How did we not... They'll be making their journey. How did we not know he existed up till now? If he's apparently this involved in the world. I have a, another guest on my manifest. Female. Hothead. Favorite weapon? Sword. Favorite tool? Sword. Favorite food? Sword? You gotta distract him. Petra. That's definitely Petra. Ah! Now I'm gonna kick the golem. Jesse! Oh man, I am so happy I found you. This freaking place. I know. Let's get out of here. At least we've got Cube Wife back. Wait, you can't. It's too dangerous. Stop them! Associates! Feeling shouty? Shouty, punchy, butt kicky, freaking admin? He tricked us. He tricked me. Oh, just is it just me or is Petra's acting Get worse this season too? Well, I know one thing. I'm glad you're here with me. You're glad, and I'm mad. I'm already grumpy today because I'm sick as shit. And the admin has Jack. It never ends with that guy. It's not a prison, it's just retail. Not gonna lie to you, Jesse. Not sure how we're gonna get out of this one. Hey, sound the alarm! We'll never make it through like this. Then we run. Where? Wherever they aren't. Alright, we're gonna get a cool Stop credit them. roll. Don't let them reach the burrows. The credit rolls are sometimes the best parts of these games. Can't make up its mind whether it's an asylum or a prison either. Neither could Arkham, that's true. It's a metaphor. To figure out where we are. Oh, wrapped in an enigma, right? What is that? Whoa! Smothered in a conundrum. Scooshed under a riddle. Great. More weird monsters. It's a metaphor. For Are what? Uh-huh. Zombies? Great. Prison zombies. Why are there prison zombies? This thing is endless. Petra. Petra! Oh Jesse! no, we've been separated. Zombie crimes, of course. Alright, let's kick this zombie. Oh, Superman punched this zombie. I really wish I had that gauntlet right about now. The gauntlet was inside of you all along. Because yeah. Cube Wife and Fisting. Not this way. Whoa! What are those things? Fighter? A creeper? 
Criders. Creating his version of what a monster should look like. Of course, I would there only be one. There's never just one. Honestly, no, no, fisting no. from a Minecraft sounds real painful. Speepers, they both say at once. Oh yeah, they are literally in hell. You called that. I know how the nether works. Oh, that's true. That's true. Other things might be square as well. Square peg goes in square hole. This is getting bonkers. Jump on the slime. Hop on the slime. Bounce on this. Oh, that's going to explode. Ah, that went better than I expected. Okay, this has been a really good credit roll. Not as good as the first chapter of the first season's credit roll, which was amazing, but very good. It's pronounced Rock Boy. Five minutes and already apprehended in an escape attempt. <sighs> that is just. That is just rude. Oh, come Take on. That's line Alice's line. And bring that one to my office. Now. The guests are super cute. Is this the office from the Shawshank Redemption? Close the door, would you? This is not subtle. <laughs> is it not? It's from some prison movie. I know Do I've seen it. Told. Go on. Close it yourself. Fine. Be defiant. Oh, I will. Oh, Large Henry. Large Henry. Defiant. Looks like I'll have to keep an extra eye on you and your crew. My crew? Oh. Let me show you. Right That's on. awesome, Xenon. You see, here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself and your punch-happy friend down there. And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be, uh, well-behaved. Your friend with the glasses is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. If you know what's good for you, Warden, you'll let them go. Oh, I'm sorry, but threats? Definitely I wonder how... Of not well -behaved. I wonder how I difficult it level. was for Would them to not give this guy a thick cartoonish German accent. Funny story. When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. Simpler times. Oh, this place is melting! Ah, oh, so disorganized! Ah, making me crazy! Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! I was so... I was so worried! Oh, this place is terrible! I'm gonna keep trying to be nice to Radar, even though I know he's gonna turn on us in the end. Oh, you were worried about me? Meet the Iron Breath Taker. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. Oh, 
Did he just say gulp? Now, that's not how that works. Follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Ready to improve that pesky bad behavior of yours and join the good guys? No, I'm just gonna hit him. As an associate, and help bring order. Can I punch him? Chaotic individual. God damn it, bad road. I see what you're doing. What's it gonna be? No freaking way, Gordon. Go eat a slime ball. Ah, some people. My story is changing. Don't say I never tried to help. Oh, whoa. Long time in there. Feeling a little dizzy. That's what happens when you clip through the when you clip through the block. Hey. Oh my gosh, Radar. Are you okay? Your eye. Jesse. Everyone's going to lose their eyes, huh? Don't worry. It's going to be it. By the end of this, there will be no one with two eyes. I knew you wouldn't give in. <laughs> We're still in this together. We are still a team. Now and forever. I'm just hoping this now isn't forever. But thanks, Jesse. Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Oh, look who joined the... How, look who joined the fascists. What a surprise. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. That's the weird lady who keeps claiming you know she's our rival? <laughs> yeah, still not your rival. Never was. Never will be. Careful, Warden. This one's crafty with the mind games. Now come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I've barely arrived and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. <sighs> Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe... I hate the Minecrafts don't friends. have throats or we could punch her in it. silver fish to fry than... than... friends. If anyone here needs a friend, it's you, Warden. Ever since the admin sent me here, I... What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange, Jesse. Let's go, rival. Yes. Hey, she was right. I am good with the go mind on, games. Jesse, to the mushroom. Exactly. The mushroom? What I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella. Okay, so far I d actually don't hate this as much as I was expecting. So far they've actually crafted something I don't hate. This is fine. We'll see if it continues to be fine. New arrivals. Show them around, would ya? Thanks. Excuse me? Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? I need a moment. <laughs> Stella's the worst. She really knows how to make a good impression, doesn't she? She's kind of the worst. Oh, you are certainly wanted to Jesse. Ta-ta, Jesse. I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive cell block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. You okay, Radar? Wish I was. I need something to eat. Get my strength back. You're in the right place. Guests make mushroom stew here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. Here's one. Hey, look, Mushroom! it's mushrooms. Tackle the mushroom. Tackle the mushroom is my favorite Sonic the Hedgehog character. No more radar. I'll find some food for you. Just rest. 
Resting. He did just have his head stuffed inside a block, so, you know. Like I say, it's really obvious he's going to turn on us. And yeah, that is absolutely just Hellboy. I hate to stare, but you're... Hellboy. Weird looking. Huh. Maybe you just need to get out more. This is what people look like where I come from. Noted. Sorry. So, what got you tossed in here? None of your business. Was it embarrassing? None of your business. What if I go first? There was this gauntlet. Stop it. Oh, I can't just keep pestering him. Got any idea how to bust out of here? Hey, you're one of us. I can tell you. Really? No. <laughs> How'd you get that bullet through there? I don't know what you heard, but you won't get any free food from me, fresh meat. Get out of here! Hey, who are you calling fresh? I'm rotten to the T-bone. As Jesse walked up to Brick, Jesse noticed that he was narrating all of Jesse's actions. How do you know my name? Bo Morgan Jesse Freeman? Was surprised to learn that the reputation of the Wither Slayer, the leader of the Order of the Stone, had spread so far. Brick was curious what Jesse thought of someone who narrated every action around himself. Brick waited for Jesse to say something. What would it be? He wondered. I'm guessing this little habit must get you beat up a lot, huh? Jesse had very astute powers of guesswork. <laughs> I need to get some food. Any tips? Brick looked out on the mycelium field, knowing that at any time, mushrooms would pop into existence. And that all fellow prisoners would have to fight to get one. Brick hoped Jesse was a worse fighter than he was. But from the looks of it, Brick is in mondo trouble. Ever try to get out of here? Brick knew I mean, we already know where Hellboy's from, Bad Road. Hell. Seemingly endless labyrinth filled with monsters and who the heck Just knows what else? Block Brick hell. Also knew that only one person has ever tried to escape, but Brick never speaks her name. But Brick will never speak of Prisoner X. <laughs> so Jesse never asked again. Can I? Oh, I can't ask again. So what are you in here for? Brick remembered the day the admin, annoyed with Brick's constant need to narrate sent him to the Sunshine Institute to break Brick of the habit. Brick was promised release if he stopped. Can't defy Morgan Freeman's narration. Never break Brick's we respect story. the narrator. <laughs> this isn't Stanley Parable, I suppose. Thanks, Brick. You're welcome. Er, Brick told Jesse, you're welcome. I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. Did someone say so potential? That won't make any I sense to anyone I else. You see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't... Sometimes you just gotta well, make a joke for you. Cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential... And you just may become... Mm. Sorry for burping the into the mic there. Champion. Can't mute it. Can't, can't, can't mute it because it's a, it's a well-coded game. Steals my keyboard commands so that OBS can't use them. Alright, so we need to get a mushroom and then craft it into soup. Just like real life. Mushroom! 
Ow. Not if I get it first. Roar. Roar. Did she just say roar? I was expecting her to go roar. Yoink. Okay, now I just need a red one. Nice. I got him. Good thing I'm the main character. Mega yay. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just so hungry. Laughing, laughing. What's going on in here? I should have known it was you causing me trouble, Jesse. Tisk. I say tisk. Did he just say just Tisk? Who this contraband belong to? Hmm? You all know that weapons are strictly forbidden at the Sunshine okay, Institute. You know who this is. So who does this belong be to? to you might as well just come out and tell me. It'll be so much easier for everyone. Large Henry won't have to pummel anyone. No one will need to be pummeled. Sure, if you call a wooden sword a weapon. Hey! Do you know how hot it was to steal all that wood, eh? Mind games! All weapons are forbidden, no matter how arguably useless they are. You know that misbehavior means getting... I also think you said Tisk, Xenon. That means... No! Not the zombie mine! Not the Ooh, zombie do you get to mine for zombies? Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten oh. flesh will teach yes. something. Oh, yes. Okay. I was joking. No more fighting. No more rule breaking. Any of you. Jeez, what a jerk. <sighs> At least now I can make some stew for radar. Because if you don't, come across that radar and become today. In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion. So I guess now we put the bowl here. Um, show recipes. Oh, I thought I would be the red one above the brown one. Apparently the red one goes on the left though. Well, it's not much, but hopefully it'll help Radar get his strength back. I have a rule against not breaking rules. So if you don't Whoa, break a rule, that's breaking a rule. Thank you, Jesse. That's but because no I'm idea, a piece I of shit. I mean, psh, I guess I'll drink this slop. <sighs> Did he just say psh? Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm going to have to really step it up. I mean, this is prison. So from now on, I'm prison radar. I'm Tasteful. Make my own mushrooms. Make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Break whatever rules I feel like. Within reason. Um, whatever, bro. Yeah. I mean, uh, whatever. Psst. Now Psst. step aside, Jesse. It's time for Prison Radar to show this world what he's made of. I'm certain he does, Bad Road. That's, That's right. what Hollywood Come teaches on, us, dude. and he looks like the kind of person who believe everything in a movie. I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped! All guests, please report to the nearest lounge. I think oh, hey, that was What's-His-Face, right? The villager? Yep. And you the the adventurer's husband? Place. Fuck, I forgot his name. Nurm, yes. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder. Prisoner X? Yeah, apparently she's this infamous prisoner who they have to keep locked up super tight. Always escaping. They say she even knows her way through that maze. It's me, I isn't it? It's Jesse. Way deep in the prison. You believe all this? It sounds pretty suspicious. Haven't we been through one of these she things with the legendary Tim? Where is she exactly? 
According to Nerm's this is another Tim, isn't it? This is locked up in the deepest, darkest level of the Sunshine Institute. Cell Block X. Detecting really? It's called... Things. Yeah, they're called big on Cell Block X. X. We need to get to Cell Block X. <laughs> Way I heard it, you can't just get into Cell Block X. Prisoner X is secretly <laughs> speed like prisoner's brother. <laughs> right next door. <laughs> if we can go down to the mines, maybe we can find this Zara person. Well... You get sent to the zombie mines if you get more in trouble, right? The warden already thinks you're bad news. Doesn't seem like that'll be too hard. Just kick up more trouble. One-way ticket to the zombie mines. Honestly, I don't care if Radar suffers at this point. My guts. Could use that to my advantage. Manipulate the man to work for us. Prison Radar votes heck yeah. I started out liking him, but he just kind of got more annoying as time went on. Stay here and rest up. I'm gonna find a way to get us to sell Yeah, I was wondering about that too. I thought maybe it had been mentioned before and I didn't want to sound silly. Had anyone mentioned Zara, the name Zara before that? <laughs> but how to get sent down to the lower levels? If no one mentioned the name Zara, then uh, I was right, and Radar's gonna turn out to be the admin the whole time. Talk about suspicious looking. There's got to be something in there. I can't or at least it. working for the admin. <laughs> it's Minecraft story mode subtle foreshadowing. This has been the most fucking predictable Telltale game so far. Pretty sure everyone specifically said they don't say their name. Yeah, Brick definitely said that. You can't hear through wool. It's soundproof. Everyone knows that. It's great insulation. Let's see what I can do with this. I mean, it's wool. You can just punch through it, so... Very slowly, apparently. I think there's another room back there. But how do I get in? That's why sheep are so stealthy. Yep. So now we're Shawshanking, eh? Am I gonna try and put this over that hole? That painting feels... out of place. Maybe there's already a hole behind it that someone dug. Secret buttons. Nice. Secret buttons. Okay. Time to see what tall, red, and gruesome is hiding. Button one. Yeah. Looks like the buttons move the blocks. Now what else moves the blocks? So that button moves that block. Those blocks. All right. Got it. So now I just hit three and two without hitting one. And now I just hit three and then hit two, and that should only move the center, right? No. This doesn't make sense. Okay. Try two. Looks like the middle button closes the middle row and opens the top row. Yeah, I, I got that. Thank you. Looks like I need to find the right combination of buttons to put all the blocks. But I have to hit all three buttons, or it just tells Looks me like to the fuck off. Left closes the top I did it. And bottom row. I was just hitting buttons at random, if I'm being honest, because the puzzle didn't make sense to me, and it didn't follow the logic I was expecting. A mushroom? What the heck are you doing here? Sounded me like I could ask you the same question. Oh, hey, it's Hellboy. what you're doing in my most private of spaces. Visitors ain't welcome, and you are most definitely a visitor. Hence, not welcome. Just looking for cell block X, big guy. Well, it ain't here, short stack. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you, you left the it. hole open. Who's this weirdo? Hmm. Holy cow! A moose 
mushroom. We can feed the entire room. Hey, hands off. My most private of spaces where the hole is open. <laughs> All right, now everyone's happy. What is going on in here? He didn't want everyone to be happy because he's the devil. He's the literal actual devil who is Satan. Anthony Shears. This is your last chance to right some wrongs. You shear this mushroom, and I promise no pain will come to them. Can I just punch him in the face? Then I can't promise to keep that promise. What? No! Don't do it, Jesse. Go to the nether and jump in a lava lake. Warden. Yeah. Take it away. No. Not my Jeffy. Oh, its name is Jeff. You don't know to stop causing trouble, do you? Well, no, I don't. I'm kind of thick like that. Dig it up. What the heck are you doing? Teaching you a lesson, Jesse. No more mycelium. Oh, so you're just gonna let them starve to death? Makes perfect sense. Will be relocated to the lower levels. The zombie mines. Well, isn't this a treat? My rambunctious rival is still now not your rival. Sir. Get moving. Oh, well, I don't have the option to, to say it. Anyway. Let's hope they're survivable. Yeah, this was my plan all along. Don't even worry about it. Welcome to the zombie mines, Jesse. Pride Llama, help Jesse, us out. You've seen it all. What exactly is this place? It's where we mine zombies. Gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect them. Pride Llama has a bobby hat. Wait. Wait, is she in, uh, is she in envy yeah. colors now? I only got a glance at her. Zombies won't fight Looks like it's just black and purple. So you never thought to question the admin? You don't question greatness, and he is the greatest. For now, at least. You brought this on yourself, Jesse. Get it? She's going to try to become the admin. Just join the admin and never had to all you really have to do is, uh... You chose to throw it all in the lava pit. All you really have to do is steal his password. For you 24 7 have made you delusional. Made you think that you can just uh, change the world. <laughs> it's sad, is what it is. Oh, such shrug. strength to be able to shrug like that. I'll give you one piece of advice. Just one. Her hair is yellow and her ascot's white. If you do, uh, you'll get there you go. With her. There's no yellow on the llama, though, and that's the one that actually matters. You those alarms earlier? That was Prisoner X. She tried to escape, but they got her back. And she... she scares me. You don't want to end up in there. So, play nice. Come along, Luna. So did Radar, like, always have that tattoo, or did it just appear when he decided to be a weirdo? Just appeared? Okay. That's what I thought. Yeah, he was wearing long sleeves before, I believe. It's so hard to keep track of details in this game, though. You know, the name of the place has sun and shine in it. And this place doesn't have either. Zombie and despair might be more accurate words. Yeah, we'll call it Zombie Despair Institute. It just flows right off the tongue. Hey guys. Hmm. Found anything? Not yet. Keeping an eye on those zombie spawners. They could go off any minute. 
We don't want to be caught unaware if they do. Now, hey, ah, what's the worst that can happen? Oh, right. This this server's on hardcore mode. Hole in wall. Hey, what is this? Fox in socks. Oh, the big guy, Oxblood. He's down for a while and headbutted the wall. Not sure why. But man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Of course there is. How do you think any of this works? I what it connects to. Slocks and socks. There you go. Hey, Radar. You okay? That mushroom. It exactly, Bad Road. Intense, huh? No kidding. Standing up to the warden, though? That's my Jesse through and through. Thanks, buddy. But those poor prisoners. No food? Rough stuff. And Stella? Here? We can't catch a break. But Who gives a shit about Stella? Let's find this prisoner X and get out of here. If you hadn't said her name just now, I honestly wouldn't have remembered what it was. There's gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey! Don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the item I frames. The warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. Well, I'm... I'm trying to escape, dude. Plain and simple truth. Don't you want to get out of here, too? That's, uh, irrelevant. No one escapes. Especially not through that door. I mean, honesty is the best policy. Hmm. So that redstone leads to this door. Who's Stanley? If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. Is Stanley another character I don't remember? Hey, guys! Over here! What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Oh, hey, streetcar Jesse, named Desire. Never seen that. Around. You know, we do know someone who came from the outside who might have all her inventory. <sighs> Stella. Stella! Alright, let's go punch her and steal her stuff. There's just boxes. Oh, hey! Uh, you want some? Fresh flesh. That is clearly rotten oh, flesh. I really like that stuff, huh? Nah. Oh. I love it! High in protein, high in flavor, maybe just a little bit poisonous sometimes, but you only live once. You sure you don't want some? Honey to go around it. What the heck? Sure. You won't regret it. <laughs> Just stick it in my pants. It's fine. Can you turn rotten flesh into anything? Is that a is that a thing you can do? What's it for? Throwable poison. All right, so I'm gonna steal her stuff and replace it with rotten flesh. Yeah, about that. I need your help. I need to make a liver. Pronto. Why exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. It's probably stupid. You want the truth? I'm trying to escape. Honesty is the best As policy. I admire you actually telling the truth. There's not a creeper's chance in a cat pack. Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. A creeper's really chance in a cat pack. Sounds like the cats are worse off. I'm not giving it up for you. No, no, no. Get your begging eyes out of here. They won't work. Yes, they will. I know what your game is here, Jesse, but I won't be intimidated. I yes, you will. Here. Respect. Um, you know, and power, and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. 
many. <laughs> oh, don't look at me like that. I'm not that person. I... Uh, okay, you're right. This isn't exactly where I wanted to be either. Okay, look. Maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Sometimes you just gotta let There's someone talk sense. themselves into a corner. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero or whatever. That's not too much, right? Sure, Stella. We'd be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. She's gonna turn on us. No matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Can I make a rotten lever? No, I guess not. I wanted to make a rotten lever. Okay, let's do this. We had someone turn on us every chapter. Did someone turn on us in the first Go chapter? Incoming! Prepare yourself! Okay, I'm trying really hard to get her to aim correctly, and it's not. Good. It's not good. Polygon Studio. Radar, you should be helping. There. Now it'll open without the combination lock. That's what we call hacking. Just hacked the shit out of this door. You guys too. Don't! Prisoner X will escape! Don't! Prisoner X will escape! I'm in. <laughs> Prisoner X was Reuben, wasn't it? Guys? Jack. Oh, of course. Of course it's Jesse. Why am I not surprised? Admin. It's not enough that you disregarded Admin. the rules in the Palace of Doom. Jesse. Admin. Order of the Sunshine Institute. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine. What gives? Pretty sure your fellow inmates were just trying to peacefully live out the rest of their captivities. I've got it hard enough in here with that nuisance. Your stupid zombie minds were just the start, Admin. I'm busting out of this prison. Oh, you really think so, eh? <laughs> boy, oh boy, I can't wait to see that. Oh, he didn't get to finish his cake. <laughs> Admin, sir. I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I, I'm ju I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. Ugh, no, not that. I'm disappointed that you couldn't keep Jesse in line for one measly day. I was just trying to do my job, and now I'm in trouble because of you. This job isn't easy to begin with. Why do you have to go and make it harder? I had to get out of this prison. Nothing personnel, kid. Personal, Warden. Oh, sure, nothing personal. Just my whole reason for existence. Oh, for the love of... Enough! I'm through letting you disappoint me. Can I punch him yet? And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially... 
especially you. Oh, me? And as for you, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty. I can't believe he's fucking dead. Suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. Gross. And as for you, Jesse, well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. He doesn't want to prove his loyalty. He's he's stuck doing this because he's being controlled by that gauntlet. I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion, and you gave it all away. He's fist control. There you go. Jack, what's going on? Uh, I'm. I'm sorry, Jesse. Are you afraid, Jesse? I'd get over it quick if you are. I'm gonna try to avoid fighting him. It's truly the Minecraft of Dark Souls. I'm not fighting you. <laughs> hey, it worked! I'm gonna trust you, Jack. Now, Jesse. Hell yeah! Oh, it almost worked. <laughs> you're you're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. I'm the goddamn juggernaut. All I ask you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. It's not that I can't do that. And I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. So this guy's actually like 12, right? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. So I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. That's... That's so sad. Oh, spare me the petty party. I don't need it. I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. The whole big After twist all. is that he's a lonely kid. Everyone loves... So, you know, a thing we've been joking about this whole time. You coming? I got your back, Jesse. Trust me. I take care of Luna for me. Coming, darling admin. Stella, it's just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line too. Lucas. Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry. I'll take good care of Beacon Town. There's a song by Dada called She's a Movie Star that's this only less cubes. <laughs> He's gone. Jesse, we gotta stop him. <sighs> Jack. Look, I am sorry, everyone. I, I can't, I just, I'm sorry. Shut up with the sorries, you doof. You big doofy doofus. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. 
The real Prisoner X was inside us all along. Man, am I glad you're okay, Jack. Hmm. Yeah, it uh, got a little dicey there for a while, didn't it? Pain after what happened with you know, not boss, and I was in the admin's freaky place, and, and uh, not in control, I was in the admin's was, freaky I was, place. I was, doing, I was in pain. I, 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 I was so scared that you'd all give up on me. Hmm. That's. That sounds horrible. Hey, I'm just glad you're back now. That's what's important, right? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Beacon Town was already worried about you, Jesse. Wondering where you were, wondering if you were okay. I'm sure the admin is heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Jesus Christ. The theft is no joke. The admin made a mistake messing with me, and I am not letting him get away with it. We made it. Whoa. Pride Llama's wiggling. How did you manage that? Oh, it was a tripwire. I thought that was a lever. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? This looks very much like something Alice would have made. You guys go on. Get prisoner X. Just over the top flowing stuff. That's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. Let's go, Nerm. Jesse, Nerm, and the Pride Llama. Okay, now all we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Come on. Oh, I love not dying. It's like my favorite thing to do. You're up next, Nerm. So it's probably a game over if you miss there. But imagine if it just let Nurm die and have the story carry on. Last jump. Yeah, I definitely like the pride scarf a lot better than the weird British cop getup. See, this makes more sense now. The preview made it look like this was going to be a mental patient thing. And... Really hoping it doesn't turn into that. Here's hoping. That's pretty mad. I'm Jesse. Sorry, I've been waiting to do that for like a year. Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle. You risk <laughs> from all this way <laughs> and have nothing to say? Oh, what a waste. I was you really hoping for an eyebrow so raise instead of an eye you're narrowing. You know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? Oh. No one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute, and no one ever will. Of course, if anyone could ever escape, uh, 
I suppose it would be me. But the admin stole my identity, and he's running around with my face, doing horrible things in my name. And my he's social security number. Now. Romeo was here. Just now. He's ruining my credit. The admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? He would want you to think that. Of course he would. How do you know his real name? Oh, we're very old friends. I know his real name. And much, much more. You must really do well, something if you I guess it. Romeo must die. Romeo never comes down here in person, except to put the warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping. Admin's mom like would not picture. be surprised. So now you want to help me? Any enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine. I always say. Well, never technically said that. I think it sounds pretty good. So glad you changed your mind. You changed my mind, Jesse. You're obviously a formidable ally. But don't forget, you do need That was the most I mean, sarcastic oh, no, the line read. You know the way, then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> well, wow, looks like we've got ourselves in a bit of a sticky piston. Can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. We're all getting out of here. No one's staying behind. Well, I'm afraid that's quite impossible, Jesse. One of them is going to have to stay. Oh, I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Hey. 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 No, you can't do that. Um, oh, come on. We seriously don't have time for this. I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. Now, this is a pointlessly heavy decision with utterly convoluted reasoning. All right, are we bringing Nurm or Luna? Bad Road says bring Nurm. Mox says bring Luna. Christy says Luna. We promised Stella that we'd take care of Luna a minute ago. Can I just grab Zara and throw her back in and leave? Sure, but I'm more worried about Luna than Stella. Alright, looks like we're bringing Luna. It's two to one. Our story is changing. You sure about this, Nurm? Hmm. Nurm also said that he would stay, so. Stella did ask me to look after her. Come on, Luna. Thanks, Nerm. You're a cool person. I promise. We'll be back for you. I don't know. How did you... My straitjacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from.
All right, it's 9.45. I'm going to take that BRB I mentioned earlier. I'm going to run one of those three-minute ad breaks. Uh, it's totally okay if you want to ad block it. All right. All right, so I guess no one could see the ad. That's good. <laughs> That's what I expect from any new Twitch feature, though, so doesn't worry me any. And like I said, not a huge deal, really. It's just... We have this option now that during BRB screens, we have, we can run an ad that may or may not eventually make us a couple bucks. So it's not a huge deal either way. Those ads will only go in normal BRB spaces. We won't be just running them during gameplay or anything, so don't worry about that. Risby, please stop. Seriously, you're being really annoying. All right, here we go. Here we go. Back to back to the game. Villagers are already kind of used to standing in one spot for like long periods of time so I'm not too worried about oh. Nerm. Uh prisoner X, I presume? Yeah. Guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. The humans. Where Where's are, Nerm? Uh, where's Nerm? Oh, your villager friend offered to take my place so my cell's booby traps wouldn't go off. <gasps> what? No. He he did that. And you let him? Zara knows how to defeat the admin. We'll come back for him when this is all over. Yeah, if there's still a nerve to come back for. <sighs> well, no matter what it takes, no matter how many heads I have to clobber, I will get him back. That's right, she cube husband. Worth it. Trust me, I'm worth it. Ugh, can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. Run for your lives! The guests have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yipes. Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back. Oh, I know what it is. Side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. I know why no one could see the ad. It's because everyone who said that they couldn't see the ad is a subscriber. And I think I have ad-free viewing for subscribers on. <laughs> so that's fun. I'm worried about the guy. Whatever happens won't be pretty. Well, beauty is subjective, but... Yeah, not gonna be nice. <laughs> Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! Shovel. Fishing rod. I could take the enchanted iron sword, or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. All right, which one am I taking? Why can't I take both? No reason. Literally no reason. All right, so uh, we're being forced to pick between an unenchanted diamond sword or a sharpened iron sword. How fucked would it be if you accidentally dropped Nerm into the fire and then had to leave Luna behind? Oh, nasty. Iron will break again, sure. But it is extra sharp. Go for the box. I don't I don't think that's uh I don't think that's an option. So if we take the iron sword 
then uh, it's going to break at an inopportune moment. And if we take the diamond sword, it won't be able to cut through something important at an inopportune moment. So either way, we're fucked. That's just how these games work. So which way would you like to be fucked is the question. All else being equal, the iron is shinier. Okay, so we got one vote for iron. Adow. <laughs> we got one vote for iron and two votes for diamond. <clears throat> oh, I know how that goes. I think I know what uh what you were typing though, so I'll just add it myself. Did I get that right? All right, three votes for diamond then. <laughs> let's do this. Oh, sorry. Um, okay. let's Definitely do this. Agreed. It's gonna fight with a shield. It's versatile. I don't know much about llama fashion, but that's a good look, Luna. Looking good. Can, can you take the hat off? E O F L. That spells my best friend. Ooh, do we get two animal friends now? Love you Are they gonna come with us? Friends reunited. Oh, that's adorable. It's a December ween mackerel. Oh, jeez. You're holding us up. Move along. Now. Whoa, don't be a dick. I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here. Come along, Jeffy. That was frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? I wanted him to come with us instead of Zara. I like him better. And we can throw Zara back in the prison cell and get uh get Nurm back. Back! Back! All of you! Oh one more step and it's He's back to being a griefer. Jesse! Warden? What's going on here? Hey! You're one of us! Help us beat up the warden! It'll be a good team building exercise! Plus, we beat up the warden! Win win! He's got a point. Oh, it's the happy little jerk who didn't like my happy little painting. I bet. Wait, you I never talked to you. I never talked to you. Why do you think I didn't like your painting? Prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore! What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's Prisoner X! Holy crud, it's Prisoner X! I think you've clearly lost your mind. She is bad news. Actually, no, she is way worse than bad news. I need her help, Warden. It's the only way to stop the admin. Did you know she was once an admin? To yep, Bob Ross, but cubic. Away. She tried to destroy him. I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what. And I'll keep that promise. He's just gonna explode Even us if all, I huh? Need to blow us all up to do it. <sighs> Well, he's dead. Oh, he's actually dead. Is that a Bob Ross Kappa? That's kind of amazing. Why are you all staring at me? It's making me uncomfortable. Hand over that bow. It's too dangerous to let you keep it. Not happening, Jesse. 
I need this weapon to get through that maze of monsters. Mazes and monsters. You answer, Zara. Uh, fine. Yes, I was an admin ages ago. Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. But I'm not Prisiful a villain pitten. here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here. Not Stickety me. piston. So glare in another direction. I'm innocent. You are just another victim of the admin, just like the rest of us. And I don't actually believe that. If he isn't stopped soon, don't believe a word she says, Jesse. She'll say whatever she can to get in your good graces. It's true. Wait. Cube so wife is wise. Can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what? Do we do I mean, it's literally like one command from the now. server administrator. Yeah. I guess we should keep moving. To remove ops from someone. I don't know if I can go with her, Jesse. Seems pretty simple, honestly. Petra, you haven't seen what the admin is capable of. We need any help we can find. Really? Her? I don't exactly have another ex-admin in my inventory, Petra. Uh, but we have to be able to... There must be a... Yeah. I don't trust her either. I want you keeping an eye on her at all times. Vigilantly. I think you know why they don't do that, Xenon. I think we've seen that before. Romeo did always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Ah, I get it. He's a modder. Seriously, what's with these monsters? They're all glowing. You're all glowing. Oh, no. No, you're not, actually. Are you scary looking, Jesse? Then let's be scarier. I'm pretty scary. Well, that was easy. This is truly the mind souls of Darkcrafts. The Minecraft Cinematic Universe. Perfect. Nice work. Thanks, Jack. Skillful. Impressive. Less talking, more stabbing. Less talking, more stabbing. Rye? No, that's not right. Rye would never say less talking. Not the llama. Like in that show, Dinosaurs. N not the llama. I'm the Jesse, gotta love me. Don't press down, do you die? Is it game over? Probably. That's how most of this goes. Radar, give me a boost. <laughs> See, I even did a drop attack, and it was instant death. That doesn't mean anything. Oh, it wasn't like this before. We there's got to be a way. She's as hoppy uh, as a creped Sarah? up Ossabot. Right there. Just oh, shut up and let me think. Uh, I knew we shouldn't have trusted her. Now we're lost. 
I said just let me think. Sure it's just thinking? I'm just going to be quiet. Would you all stop staring at me already? Hey, Jeez. I stopped talking. Wait, we can just build to the top. A hop on pop ocelot. Oh, we're building. We're building. There's mine weed in this cannon. There is mine hey, weed wait. in every cannon. Where are you going? She ditched us. She's an OC who is a crazed up hop a lot. So that's a ghast with other smaller ghasts on its face. Don't come up here. What? Why? No reason. Oh, okay, got it. These really are like the type of mods that a ten year old would make. Three headed gas? Why would the admin create that? So is this the boss fight? Is it already almost over? Ganon. Hey, Andy, welcome back. Oh, I'm supposed to be dodging, huh? Oh, wrong way, apparently. Okay. Okay, I can't tell which ones I'm supposed to dodge and which ones I'm supposed to hit back. That other gas just kind of approached and then disappeared. So, good. Is this to speed up or slow down? Okay. It's weird that there's like a boss fight here. Like an actual boss fight. This isn't something you expect in Telltale. Oh god, I just made it aggro. I made them aggro it. This is cute. It doesn't control remotely well just as one might expect from an adventure game suddenly having an action scene. Am I winning? Sort of? Press A to can oh. Okay. Apparently I looked away from the screen at just the wrong moment. I think that's its weak point. Yeah, these uh these explosions don't look so good. Okay, I hit A there instead of X and it still worked, so that's weird. I fucked up the press before. It doesn't normally work anyway. Yeah, that was the end of the game. So now it's trying to look like Shadow of the Colossus. This is cute. 
I'm definitely enjoying this chapter more than the first two. Stuff's actually happening. That was unbelievable. And you stuck the landing. Nice. Andy, that was ghastly. Perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory. Well, there it is, guys. Our ticket out of here. That is sparkly. The sparkliest. Is that diamond? Where is everyone? That maniac is gonna get herself killed. Would that be such a bad thing? We should lend her a hand. That killer is gonna get herself maimed. But she sounds like she's in serious trouble. All right, we went through the trouble of getting her. Help her escape. Time to prove it. Resby, what are you doing? Come on. You are being such a pain in the ass today. Leave. We're risking our lives for another admin. You came back. I said I'd get you out, didn't I? Now, show us the way. I know you didn't have to do that. I appreciate it. I'm certain most people saved her. Oh, we can't tell because this game doesn't connect to the Telltale servers anymore. I'm not a very trusting person. Romeo betrayed me. I have trouble getting along with others. Oh, so now you're going to explain to us... I ever really Your uh, personality. You're welcome, Zara. I would do it again. It was the right thing to do. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Where Fred the admin. Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. <sighs> it's tragic backstory o'clock. Where's the rest of it? I so, ate it, I sorry. This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up. We're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go. Below the Admins bedrock. can break bedrock, right? There's nothing under the bedrock except nothing. And also certain death. <sighs> we're not at the bottom of the world. It only appears that way. I really do want to believe you. Then believe me. Instead of arguing, I'm let's find out. Amazed that listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. But that's crazy talk. All those monsters. I don't care. She's an admin. An admin killed boss, then stole his identity, and then. Remember, I told you he took my admin powers away. Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. Oh, I don't even have the option to say no. See? I told you. These stairs lead to our salvation. One sec, I'm gonna look at this link. Bitches don't know about my tragic backstory. That's from that, uh, that's from that lesbian game, right? Yes, probably. <laughs> uh, Lady Killer in a Bind, right? That's the one? Alright. See, I can, I, I can remember things. <laughs> now there is a good reason to get a move on. Hey, look, Enderman. Lesbian bondage anti-capitalist harem anime. Ah. Episode 3, Jail... Oh, the, the chapter's starting. So that's... That's chapter 3. It was better. It was better. 
I'm glad I went through with that. I expected it to be worse, but it was better instead of that. I can't let anyone run around disguised as me or my friends. The amount of chaos they could cause is... Well, it's unthinkable. She still has a British accent. That's why I summoned you. It's Lucas, isn't it? Track them down. It's it's Make Lucas. Sure behaving themselves. So that's like obviously Lucas, right? <coughs> Man. Oh jeez. <coughs> <laughs> Run, 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 Jesse. As fast as you can. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely Lucas. And now we're gonna end up fighting Lucas, and we'll have to convince him that we're the real Jesse. <laughs> the game is not the game is not subtle. I'll be very surprised if I'm wrong on that one. All right, so that's that's episode three. I'm glad we continued with that. That was fun. That was fun. That was memorable. That was good, which the first two chapters were very, very mediocre at best. So we'll be back to this next week. Excellent, excellent. And hopefully it continues at this pace because uh, that's, that's excellent. I'm going to say excellent one more time now. Excellent. Tomorrow is the beginning of Act 2, the reboot of the beginning of Act 2 of Tale, the tabletop RPG that Katie runs with the players who are Christy and also who are Mox and also who are Xenon. And that's excellent and a lot of fun and very cool and funny and dark and emotional and weird and uh, furry animals. So definitely come around for that. Thursday will be Alice with uh, Batman the Enemy Within, chapter 3 or 4. 3, I think. 3, yeah. And uh, she's making friends with the Joker, so the Joker will be Batman's sidekick. Just, just like the stories you know about Batman. Friday. Friday will be Katie with Press Any Key doing horror games collected by the evil video game sorceress known as Christy. And that's, that's always great. Christy, Christy picks out some really good lineups of games and very Katie's excited. just, and she's very excited. And it's, and Katie's just really good at, at that in general because she's, she's angry just all the time. She's not actually i don't know why i said that saturday's the day off sunday will be zoo with more code vein which is fucking excellent she may also do bonus streams earlier in the week um just if she decides that she wants to stream earlier in the week so uh you may want to tune in in the afternoon if you see a notice go up and monday will be christy with more more darkest dungeon and uh, hopefully Stuff. She's gonna skip the tutorial stuff and jump into the real the real video game part of of the game, which is good. There was a lot of technical difficulty the other night. It turns out Cox was having trouble all weekend all over the country, so that's great. Good good ISP managing to fuck over literally all of their customers over the space of a couple days. But it seems to be better now. We have lost zero frames today, which hasn't happened in a couple weeks, at least. And then Tuesday's back around me with more Minecraft Story Mode Season 2 here. Uh, episode 4 is called Below the Bedrock. Which, I guess we're going to meet Fred Flintstone or something. You can follow us. Uh, you can subscribe to us. You know that. You know that. Thanks for all your support. And we've got uh, four more streaming channels. Not we, but our friends who are part of the truck community stream. And you can see them below in the stream team box here at truck.community. If any of y'all truck community streamers are going live after this, please tell me and I will uh, hit that host button. 
Thanks so much, everyone. We'll see you tomorrow. Peace.